due to the nature of grinding, I have defeated so many Rhydons, Rhyhorns, Onyxes, and Gravelers that I'm pretty sure I've single-handedly caused population crises with these species. And I do not regret a thing. There is no meme. This is just a threat. Hey, welcome back to Pokemon Crystal. It is time, at last, for the champion. And leading my charge is not that one, is this one. My lovely cow, Otis. I leveled everything up to 43, and now it has Body Slam. Littlefoot's the exact same. It could have learned Light Screen, but I need Cut. And admittedly, I should be fine with Reflect. Goku, it has Cross Chop now. Eh? That turn you on? Green Schwarzer is the same as he ever was. Axel has Flamethrower instead of Fire Punch. And Oingo Boingo is the exact same. So. Let's just begin. With totally not Lorelei. Like you can. Like I'm not crazy right. The color scheme here very clearly indicates that it was still supposed to be an ice type trainer right. And now it is this gentleman. Welcome to the Pokemon League, Step 11. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Will. I have trained all around the world, making my psychic Pokemon powerful. And at last, I've been accepted into the... Like, what happened to Lorelei? Agatha was old. Like, I can make assumptions about what happened to her. And we know what happened to Blue and Red. But Where'd Lorelei go? Also, does Will wear a mask, or is his face just shrouded in darkness? Many questions that I'm sure a model in Pokemon Masters, or actually now that I think about it, HeartGold SoulSilver probably clearly has what he looks like. Alright. Will exists to show off Zatu. <laughs> That's what he does. He has two of them. And he also exists to try my patience right from the word go. Alright, Otis. There we go. None but a thing. Alright. We have defeated one bird. Alright, Jinx has the defenses of a wet paper bag. So yeah, one Shadow Ball should be all I need for her. There we go. So frail, she gets KO'd by a coverage move. Hey, Executor, I like that guy. Shadow Ball. I'm thinking, is there anything I need to do other than just keep hitting the Shadow Ball button? And I don't think so. God, I forgot what Psychic sounded like in this generation. Oh, that's a lot of damage. Right. Exeggutor is one of the most powerful special attackers in the game. I'm pretty sure even to this day, he is one of the most powerful special attackers in the game. Alright, now Slowbro might be a little trickier. Given his incredibly high physical defense. Yep. Well, uh, sure, sure. Y keep having amnesia. You're right, Slowbro. So true, King. So true. Alright, so... I don't know what Slowbro is setting up for. But I'm going to drink my milk. Because I don't know what he can really do to me. The same thing Exeggutor did. Right. Haha, -ha, but you did less damage. Um, I'm I'm pretty sure there's no point in trying for a rollout, because I know his last Pokemon. It's his other Zatu. Yeah, like. 
You don't... You don't scare me. Well, I'm still faster. I wasn't expecting that. Ooh! Hell yeah! Nice, easy cow sweep. Alright. Surely the rest of the Elite Four will go just as easy, right? Right? Alright, next up is using a potion. Let's just give that to you. Perfect. Now, Koga. You lead with, I believe, an Ariados? Ariados? I don't know. Axel. Or, wait, 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 wait. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. If he leads with one of his poison types... <laughs> I am Koga of the Elite Four. I live in the shadows, a ninja. My intricate style will confound and destroy you. Confusion, sleep, poison. Prepare to be the victim of my sinister technique. <laughs> Pokemon is not merely about brute force. Yep, true. I have strategies too. Like, uh, milk drink. Yeah, it was Arian. I remember. Why do I remember random things like that and not things that would actually be helpful to me in the real world? Alright. Well, regardless, this should be a nice, easy one-shot. Then, you're gonna send out your Fortress. And then I can one-shot that, too. Huh? Wow. <laughs> what? You know what, buddy? Your call. You, 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 you do what you want to do. Now, if I remember correctly... After Fortress, he actually just has poison types. I believe his Weezing, Muck, and then a Crobat, I think? Or is it Karen that has Crobat? No, Karen doesn't have Crobat, she has Murkrow. I think. Regardless, Reen Schwarzer is going to be the, the, the move here. Okay. I mean, that's fine. Dodge this earthquake. Okay. Alright. Muck might dodge this earthquake. S solid chance. Never mind. I'm built different. I'm constructed in an unorthodox fashion. I My strategy is simply superior to yours. You never had any hope. Venomoth, right. I thought he had a Crobat. It would seem that he does not, in fact, have a Crobat. However, my strategy is actually the same as if he did have a Crobat. <laughs> wow. That is powerful. Okay, well, that's not going to do, like, anything, right? Yeah, no, I'm fine. Alright, Schwarzer? Yes. Alright, there we go. And now your last Pokemon, I believe, is your trademark, um, Weezing. No, it is the Crobat! I... I'm still using Rock Slide. Oh, you are going to be annoying. That's okay. I should only need two rock slides to land to KO you. That's not going to be easy. I don't have anything with, like, sure accuracy. Oh. I... Well, here's the thing. Crobat can't do anything to a Steel-type. So we're just going to sit here until I chuck enough rocks at you to KO you. Which is happening sooner than I expected. Wow, what a range. Okay. 
I did not expect it to be that easy. I subjected to everything I could you to everything I could muster. You you just use minimize and double team. Like that was your strategy. Granted, not a terrible strategy, but you must have not watched this series. The real elite strategy to beat me is the move Twister. Do you have the move Twister? Because that will be quite powerful. Next up, good old Bruno. Training in his room of lava with no fences. How did OSHA approve of this? I am Bruno of the Elite Four. I always train because I believe in our potential. That is how we become strong. Can you with... Yeah, I'm not afraid. At all. I mean, what do you have? You have the three Hitmons, and Onyx, and a Machamp. Like... Bruno exists to show off my... Like, that's what the Elite Four in this game does really well. Is all of them are showing off a Pokemon you probably haven't seen before. Huh, <sighs> so you're gonna be doing this, huh? No, that's fine. I mean, I am a Slow King. I am not very fast. This is going to be a two-shot. Oh? Come on, come on, come on. G give me, give me, give me, give me. Come on. Let me have this, please. Okay. Fine. Dig your hole, which is somehow not hitting the lava. I'm not going to question that. Really? Well, hang on. I got a, like, one-turn confusion... I think, in the fight against Koga. So, I can't complain too much, but... Eh, come on. All RNG should go my way, and when it doesn't, that's just bad game design. Alright, Hitmonchan is gonna hit me with a Thunder Punch that does 15 damage. Okay. Really? That's how we're doing this? It also did a bit more than 15 damage. It did like 20-something. 20 25. Alright, well, Oingo Boingo can take out two of the Hitmons. And if Hitmon Lee misses with high jump kick, it can take out three Hitmons. It would be so over for you hoes if I could learn, um, uh, Psychic. I mean, Slow King does get it naturally soon enough. Oh, ho, ho, a critical! Oh, drop something. Don't worry about it. You heard nothing. Wow, you are just not sending out Onyx. Which, like, I get it. Ah, oh, How did you miss a fully paralyzed Pokemon? Like, how do you do that? Well, there's only one thing that can be done here. Alright, baby. Let's jam! Good, 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 good. If he gets the crit and I don't, I die. Alright. Boo! Boo! Cheater. Cheater, cheater, pumpkin eater, that's what you are. Now I gotta land three cross chops, I landed three cross chops. Hell, oh, and now you get the crit. Whatever, you know, that, that was an important battle. Hey, Onyx. Might I interest you in a cross cha Wait, you have no attack. I'm fine. Got him. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about, baby. 
three Elite Four members, only one Pokemon got knocked out. Huh. Not bad. Alright. Hyper Potion. That is Oingo Boingo. Oingo Boingo is dead. I need to use a revive. My mistake. I know I have revives in this bag somewhere. I made sure to buy them. Oh, there they are. We are doing pretty well for ourselves, I gotta admit. Let me give it a little bit of the Hyper Potion. A little bit of the Hyper Potion again. We sure is fine with what he's got. And then, where is my supply of Ethers? Yes, right here. You are going to need to give Goku back his Cross Chops. Because he's about to do a whole lot of chopping. Because Karen is a dark type trainer. And she has three whole dark types. I am Karen of the Elite Four. You're Steph Eleven. How amusing. What's so amusing about my name? The fact that there's a Roman numeral in it? Stop being so close-minded. Also, not gonna lie. As a kid, I thought Karen was an old woman. Because I was thinking of Agatha, and like, her hair looked white to me here, not blonde. Or no, I think it is white. She just looks like an old woman here to me. And then Heart Gold Soul Silver was like, nope. This is, this is just a woman of average age. Alright. Super effective hit on Umbreon, but Umbreon is beefy as heck. But the high critical hit ratio of Cross Chop will see me through. Now, Goku has no way to damage a ghost type, so please don't send out your Mistrevious. Thank you. But I also don't want Goku to fight this thing. So, Axel. You should be able to handle this. Okay, as long as Paralysis doesn't kick in an obnoxious number of times, I have no reason to fear. Alright. Got her. So your other Pokemon, if I'm remembering correctly, are Murkrow, Houndoom, and Mistrevious. Or Mistrevious, I don't remember how it's spelled. Gengar. I didn't think you had a Gengar. I misremembered then. Do you not have a Houndoom? Do they really reserve Houndoom for just uh Archer? Okay. Well, I'm going to just kill you with Earthquake. Wow. You are an Elite Four member. And you're using Lick. Man, I forgot how move pools just were not invented for a while. Well, this is how I deal with flying types. Nah. Bring in the cow. Okay, never mind. We are... L Goodbye, cow! I mean, you have a super effective move, so... I can try? You know what? No. We're going to bring back in the steel type that you can do absolutely nothing to. Alright? And then I'm going to throw rocks at you. Capiche? Alright, here we go. Wow, that wasn't even a crit. 
That was just how much damage I did. Huh. Okay. Rain Schwarzer's time to shine, I guess. Oh, you... I could have sworn you had a Mistrevious. Alright, well, you're gonna use, like, Flamethrower and kill me in one shot, aren't you? Yep. No, that, that's fair. That, that's fair. You are four levels higher than me. Alright, Oingo Boingo. That's what you were made for. Surf him! And thanks to Oingo Boingo's high special defense, that's not going to be a one-shot. This surf, however... Well, this is going to be... Oh, okay, 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 good, 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 it's fine. You've merely given me an opportunity to land a critical hit, you fool. I did not land the critical hit. And Oingo Boingo is dead as a doornail. Alright, that's fine. I have no qualms with that being how it is. Goku? You're going second anyway, so just use Vital Throw. Vital Throw? Can't possibly miss. So... Goodbye, Houndoom. And with that, Karen is no more. I have vital thrown her out of existence. Strong Pokemon. Weak Pokemon. That is only the selfish perception of people. Truly skilled trainers should try to win with their favorites. Yeah, but my favorite Pokemon are, uh, Land... Landorus, Heatran, and, I don't know, Pokemon competitive at all. I just know that, um, it's really funny... That Pokemon like Heatran and Landorus that are basically just nothing to the general Pokemon community because they were like post-game legendaries that don't matter at all are infamous for actual competitive Pokemon. The only other thing I know about competitive Pokemon is that Ferrothorn is homophobic and that has had ramifications in the OU meta. Alright, re- alright. Last heal up before the final battle. Alright. Hyper Potion. Okay. Everyone is at full health. Um, I have an elixir. I, I uh, I don't need the max elixir, I just need one elixir. And just use that on Reen Schwarzer. Few of your moves could use it. Alright. And we're actually gonna lead with Littlefoot. The only member of the team that hasn't gotten a chance to do anything yet. Hello there. Lance. I've been waiting for you. Stev11. I knew that with your skills, you would eventually reach me here. There's no need for words now. We will battle to determine who is the stronger of the two of us. As the most powerful trainer and the Pokemon League champion, I accept your challenge. Here we go, baby. That Gen 2 music, baby. Look at him in that cape. Alright. Let's lead off with Reflect. Alright, Rain Dance, a little problematic, but really not too bad. Now I'm gonna Body Slam you. Okay, Flail, I have Reflect up. I'm gonna use Body Slam, my hope is to paralyze you. Perfect. Alright. 
Yeah, you're using Surf. I don't particularly care. Even with the Rain Dance, that's not going to do a whole lot. Alright. Keep going with Body Slam. Maybe I can... Yeah, fully paralyzed. Rain continues to fall. Alright. That's one KO. It's exactly what I was looking for to start off. Okay. One of his Dragonites. That's fine. Rain has stopped. Reflect has faded. I'm gonna hope for another Paralysis. Alright, cool. I'm gonna be honest, Body Slam is not how I intended to sweep through Lance. That is part of how I intended to sweep through Lance. Alright. Fully paralyzed. Let's just keep getting you weaker. Uh, okay. Um... Okay, this is not, this is not what I intended. Uh, is wing attack going to one shot? It is, okay, okay, okay. Now I've set up reflect. And, uh, if Littlefoot can also paralyze... This is going to be absurd. Dang it. Okay. Littlefoot, you did fantastic. Where are you, baby? Otis. Now, remember what I said a while ago. A long time ago. About how X-Accuracy works. X-Accuracy... I have Reflect up. I have... Reflect. Now, with the X accuracy in place, all of my accuracy checks are perfect. Otis, begin. Alright, I no longer have Reflect. However... Use a max potion. Oh, dang it. Oh, that's bad. That's gonna hurt. Alright. I now have two incredibly powerful rollouts locked and loaded in the chamber. If Otis outspeeds this Dragonite, which I think she will because, um, Littlefoot could, this should be another KO. Yep. And now you're gonna send out your Charizard, I think? Yep. And you know what this is gonna be? Another KO. Perfect. That is the strategy I was trying to set up. Alright. So here it is. The final Dragonite. Should I attempt a milk drink? I'm gonna try for milk drink. Yeah, yeah, come on, cow. You can do it. Alright, outrage is bad. Alright, I'm not gonna... I gotta hope for a clutch paralysis with body slam. Then I can just switch into Oingo Boingo. Oh. Otis, you beautiful cow. Otis, it's been an honor. Because with that chip damage and the paralysis, Oingo Boingo should be easily able to punch this thing into oblivion. Oh yeah, baby. I did not expect Littlefoot to... Do as much as they did. Huh. Well. Whew. You have become truly powerful, Stev Eleven. 
Your Pokémon have responded to your strong and upstanding nature. As a trainer, you will continue to grow strong with your Pokémon. And here's the Professor! Also, shout out to Professor Elm not even being allowed to be here. Like... Does it happen every single time? I'm pretty sure until Gen 5. I don't think Juniper shows up at the end of Gen 5. Only because the end of Gen 5, a bunch of stuff happens. But like, Gen 1, Professor Oak showed up. Gen 3 was Birch. Gen 4 was Rowan. Oak shows up in Gen 2 as well, because Professor Elm's just not allowed. I did it! Let's interview the brand new champion. You gotta appreciate a woman who knows what she wants. She's like, frame one. New champion, I'm getting that scoop and you can't stop me. <laughs> That's cute, I like that. And then it uses the opening town music. It's been a long time since I last came here. This is where we honor the Pokemon League champions for all eternity. Their courageous Pokemon are also inducted. Here today, we witness the rise of a new League champion. A trainer who feels compassion for and trust toward all Pokemon. A trainer blah 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 just put me in the machine. Put my consciousness into the machine so that I may outlive humanity. There she is. Meganium. Actually a lot better than I thought she'd be. She kind of fell off in the middle of the game where I was facing a lot of rocket grunts and Pokemon that couldn't really do much that she couldn't really do much against. But honestly, Meganium's not as bad as I thought she'd be. All of you Chikorita fans. You, you got it you got a new shooter. Well, they're not a new shooter. I still don't like grass types. But I think she's better than I gave her credit for. That was a good Elite Four. 97 Pokemon owned. You seem to like collecting things. I sure do. I sure do. Oh, look at Pichu. Adorable. Man, rem like, remember when games could be made with, by comparison, a team this small? I mean, I guess they still can. But for huge games, nowadays, costs are bloated. There are 30 million employees, half of whom are going to get laid off for no goddamn reason. Uh, game Freak. You are under a lot of fire in recent times for being forced to shit out games at an alarming pace. But I'll be honest, you do make some damn good games. Ditto! <laughs> Look at how jiggly he is. Ditto is just a blob, but it is also a fantastic creature. buff. Okay, there it is. Why does it have that symbol on its head? Like, the little swirl there. That's not an aspect of Jigglypuff or Wigglytuff's design, so why does it have that? Hmm. I need to go to Japan and ask its creator. Anyone down for a field trip? I love Pokemon. So much. Now, do I intend to go through Kanto? Maybe. Probably. To be honest, I wasn't sure if I wanted to go through Kanto when I started this Let's Play. But now that I've been playing it, yeah. I want to go through Kanto. Yeah. How long has this episode been? 34 minutes! Hmm... No. There is something I need to... need to do. Professor Elm... Hello! I have something here for you. Yeah, that's not what I'm going to do. 
I have unfinished business to attend to. And we're going to use the power of speeding up to... You know what, I'm just going to walk there manually. I have an old nemesis that I need to take care of. A Pokemon that has eluded me for many episodes ago. You can probably, if you've been paying attention, know what I'm talking about. There's only one encounter that I've just straight up failed. Scyther at the bug catching contest. You will be mine. Wait, do you know? Is it not? Is it not today? Oh! I thought. Ah, sure enough, it is Friday. Well! This is. Awkward. Hmm.